Ben's pole pedal paddle will kick off tomorrow for the first time in three years. Our Jordan Williams is at the event with everything you need to know. Jordan? Good afternoon, Noah, and good afternoon, Central Oregon. That is right. We are back at the pole pedal paddle for the first time in three years. Of course, 2020 and 2021 were canceled due to COVID-19. Now, for whatever reason, if maybe you're unfamiliar with how the pole pedal paddle works, well, there are six sections in it. They start up at Mount Bachelor in an alpine skiing portion that's made for beginners and intermediates. It's not too hard and people go down it pretty quickly. And then there's a eight kilometer, about a five mile Nordic ski portion of it. And then there's a 22 mile bike ride, a five mile run. Then they get to the sprint portion where there's a one and a half mile kayak race and then a one mile run. And I want to make sure I got all of that. Yep, that's correct. So there are a, a lot of things happening here before us at the river, in front of us at the, or I should say behind us at the River Bend Park. There's a lot of boats. People are dropping off their boats. We're here at the kayak drop off. There's about 2,000 competitors. So there's a few hundred boats here. People compete in individuals, pairs, and teams. And we're now going to welcome in the race director, Molly Cogswell Kelly, who is with Mount Bachelor Sports Education Foundation. And Molly, just tell me how excited are you to be back? Of course, the last two years were canceled. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Everyone is fired up and um yeah just a little bit i kind of forgot how much work it is to put this on but it's been great and so everyone has just been so supportive and um you know we have a few challenges possibly with weather tomorrow but um everyone's just been really positive and they're like you know what this is going to be a pole pedal paddle that they'll tell their grandkids about yeah and that's <laughs> the thing we're talking about we're, of course we're here to talk about the weather there's probably going to be some showers tonight tomorrow morning potentially some showers so does that change anything for the race it, it yes it, it could um we're crossing our fingers that everything is going to be great and it might be warmer than 34 but with um, the rain that might accumulate um, tonight overnight um, with the snow it will make um, the the lifts like the Pine Martin chairlift it could ice up and if that is if that happens then we may have to delay the start just a little bit but um I've already talked to ODOT they're great they're gonna plow there's probably only gonna be like one inch of snow they're gonna plow early in the morning um, all the gravel is gone which is great and so the road I don't think the road like when people are on their bikes I don't think that's gonna be an issue okay. um, it's just gonna be cold okay. and so everybody dress warm okay. um, you know so you're telling people to dress warm there could be some rain showers happening, maybe some snowflakes up at Bachelor at the start of the race. Thank you so much, Molly.